श्रीमते भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती नमो विष्णुपदाय गौरपृष्ठाय भूतले श्रीमती भक्ति वेदांत नमो विष्णुपदा आचार्य सिंहरूपिणे श्री श्रीमद्भक्ति प्रज्ञा केशव नमो विष्णुपदा भूतले श्रीमते भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती नाम वंशकलपतरुश कृपसिंधु पतिता पवने वैष्णवी नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नरचम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जय मुदीर सर्वप्रथम अस्मदीय परमाराध्य तम गुरुपाद पद्म ओम विष्णुपाद अष्टूत सत श्रीमद भक्ति वेदांत शिल बामन गोस्वामी महाराज तथा ओम विष्णुपाद अष्टूत सत श्रीमद भक्ति वेदांत शिल नारायण गोस्वामी महाराज तदीय चरण जुगल में असंख्य कोटि दंडवत प्रणति निवेदन करता उपस्थित मंच पर आशी पूजनीय सन्यासी वर्ग सभी को मेरा प्रणाम निवेदन है तथा आज की सभा में सोपस्थित समस्त पूज्य वैष्णव जन समस्त माताएं बहनों भाइयों अतिथियों सभी को मेरा प्रणाम निवेदन है करके एक और हम लोगों का परम सौभाग्य का विषय है कि हम लोग प्रतिवर्ष की भांति से ब्रजमंडल परिक्रमा में सुपस्थित हुए हैं और आज एक ही मंच पर जो सभी सन्यासी वर्ग हमारे संघ के समस्त भक्त जा और आप सभी लोग सौपस्थित हुए पिछले वर्ष कार्तिक व्रत के अंत में श्री गुरु जी ने 
शब्द से माइक पर ही गोवर्धन में बताया था कि मैंने संपूर्ण विश्व में बहुत बार भ्रमण किया और साथ ही साथ मैंने बहुत से शब्दों को प्रकाशित किया आप लोगों के समक्ष प्रस्तुत किया आई स्पोक सो मेनी काइंड वर्ड्स आई ट्रेवल सो मेनी टाइम्स सो आई रिक्वेस्ट एवरी वन ऑल माई सर्स एंड ऑल माई डॉटर्स एवरी वन प्लीज कम इन ब्रजमंडल परिक्रम एंड नवोदय धाम परिक्रम This is very very important. Other way, Guru Dev told everyone follow my words. I am waiting for everyone. Guru Dev spoke. Guru Dev. All I present and all I is blessing us. We know good day to pass to long distance, but we are feeling. Gurudevi Bharaniya and all his blessings <laughs> Today Silabhat Pragya Kesav Gur Sahib Maharaj our Param Guru Maharaj hum logo ke Param Guru Maharaj Silabhat Pragya Kesav Gur Sahib Maharaj unki bhi जो आज के दिन में इस भौतिक जगत से साधना की पूर्ण सिद्धि में ब्रज लीला में और गौर लीला में प्रवेश किए हैं और नित्य लीला में एक और राधा गोविंद की सेवा में दूसरी और गौर परिकर बनकर विप्रलम्ब रस के आस्वाद इस प्रकार हमारे परम गुरु महाराज शिल गुरु महाराज शिल भक्ति वेदांत शिल बावन गोस्वामी महाराज वे परम धाम में नित्य विराजमान होकर सब पर आलोक पात दृष्टिपात और कोरोना का प्रसन्न करते हैं फिर भी आज हम लोग जो कि कार्तिक व्रत का प्रारंभ है शरद पूर्णिमा है श्री कृष्ण के शारदीय राज पूर्णिमा और हम बैठे हैं सभी रास स्थली में जो एक और इमली तला दूसरी और श्रृंगार वहाँ एक सौ करोड़ प्रजुगोपिया यहाँ सभी कृष्ण के उस सुंदर के बिरह भी प्रलम्ब में गोपी गीत का गायन किया और कृष्ण साथ साथ मनमत मनमत होकर प्रकट हुए यहीं पर उन्होंने गोपियों को दर्शन दिया उन्हें मनाया प्रेम में रीझे और हाथ पकड़ कर खींच लिए उनके साथ रास नृत्य किया यही है गोविंद स्थल जो किसी कृष्ण दास कविराज गोस्वामी पास वर्णन करते हैं गोविंद लीला मृत में वो जमुना पुलिस और यमुना के मध्यवर्ती टापू 
जब गोपियों की कृष्ण की इच्छा होती है भावना होती है तब यहीं से निकल के आते हैं और वे ही जानते हैं चैतन चैता में कहा दस सुख वस लादि भावे ना है गोचर दूसरे दूसरे भावों के व्यक्ति वे समझ ही नहीं सकते हैं कहा वो गोविंद साहब जहां रास लीला होती है ऐसे भगवान जहां श्रृंगार रस राजमय मूर्ति रहा जहां श्रृंगार रस का आस्वादन करते हुए विश्व जगत को प्रेम का संदेश दिया प्रेम प्रकाशित कर दिया ऐसे ही स्थल में हम लोग आज आए हैं श्री गोपीनाथ भवन में हम लोग श्री गुरु जी के अनुगत में उनकी कथा प्रेम का पान करते हुए उनके आदर्श विचारधारा सिद्धांत और उनके वाणी का अनुसरण करते हुए हम लोग अपने जीवन को उस रूप में ढाल सके और आज गुरु जी की आए तो की करुणा से श्री राधा दामोदर मंदिर में जो कि हमारे शिला भक्ति वेदांत श्री नारायण गोस्वामी महाराज तथा शिला भक्ति वेदांत श्री बावन गोस्वामी महाराज जी की पुष्प समाधि प्रस्तुत हो चुकी है और अभी थोड़ी देर में ही यहाँ पुष्पांजलि आदि समापन करके हम लोग यमुना में जाएंगे संकल्प लेते हुए राधा दामोदर मंदिर में जाएंगे और उस पुष्प समाधि का उद्घाटन करेंगे और इस समाधि मंदिर को बनाने में जो कि हमारे पूज्य पंच जगन्नाथ पू जी आए यहाँ आते ही उनके मन में भावना आई कि हम कुछ करें क्या करें जल्दी से जल्दी हम क्या कर सकें तो इसलिए उन्होंने अपना अनुकूल विधान करते हुए और उस पुष्प समाधि को निर्माण करने में श्रेय दिया है जो कि आज हम उनको भी विशेष धन्यवाद ज्ञापन करते हैं पूज्य बात श्री जगन्नाथ पूजा जी से हमारे पी संघ की जो चेयरमैन है और हम सब की संरक्षक हैं पालक हैं और हम सभी बच्चों को स्नेह आशीर्वाद के द्वारा जो सदैव सुरक्षा करते हैं हित उपदेश देते हैं पूज्य पास श्री जगन्नाथ प्रभु और हमारे बी टी आई संघ के सभी मेंबर सभी सदस्य यहाँ सब उपस्थित हैं हम सभी के साथ और सभी सन्यासियों के साथ में जाएंगे इससे पहले आज के कथाक्रम जो श्री राधा दामोदर व्रत आज से ही प्रारंभ हो रहा है अभी 10 बजे से फिर से यहाँ पर कथाएं प्रस्तुत होंगी और शाम को भी कथाएं होंगी और सभी लोग मंच पर आसीन होकर कथाएं पढ़न करेंगे अभी मैं निवेदन करता हूँ वैष्णवों से थोड़ा थोड़ा करके कुछ पुष्पांजलि समर्पण कर दें फिर चलेंगे हम लोग पुष्पांजलि पर साढ़े सात बजे अभी सात बजे जा रहा है हम निवेदन करते हैं पूज्य पर से माधव महाराज जी कुछ वर्णन करें ज्ञानतिरांधस गैनाजन सलाकया चक्षुर्मीत तस्म श्रीगुरव नम आविर्भूत सकार शिवामन नारायण रूपानुग प्रवर उदेशव प्रिय भजे
Ecco. Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu Aparamahimanitam Bajamahi Prema Murti Narayan Guru Pungabam I pay my humble obeisances unto the lotus feet of my Paramaratha Guru Pad Padma Om Vishnu Pad Paramahansa Swami Astotara Sata Sishimad Bhakti Vedanta Srila Bhaman Goswami Maharaj and Om Vishnu Pad Paramahansa Swami Astotara Sata Sishimad Bhakti Vedanta Sila Narayan Gosai Maharaj I offer my humble obeisances and the lotus feet of my spiritual grandsire Nitya Lila Prabhuswam Vishnu Pad Sishmad Bhakti Pragyan Kesa Goswami Maharaj and Nitya Lila Prabhuswam Vishnu Pad Sishmad Bhakti Vedanta Sila Swami Maharaj I convey my Dandavat Pranam to all Vaishnavas and Vaishnavis, headed by Tidandi Sannasis and senior and sincere devotees, especially Pujabhad, Sivakti Vedanta Tirtha Maharaj, Sivakti Vedanta Parivrajak Maharaj and Sivakti Vedanta Padmanam Maharaj. Today, the DC Appearance Day of और परम गुरुदेव श्री लभक्ति प्रगान के सब समी महाराज। If we want to know about him, then how we can know him? We can know through the vision of his associates. Like if any tree, if you ask what is your identification, we can know the tree by his fruit. फले न परिचित थे। In same way. If we want to know the glory of Srila Bhakti Bhagavan Kesa Goswami Maharaj, only the light of our omniscient Guru Pada Padma, our Guru Vargas, like Srila Bhakti Vedanta Bhavan Goswami Maharaj, Srila Bhakti Vedanta Narayan Goswami Maharaj, and Srila Bhakti Vedanta Vikram Goswami Maharaj. The invocation slok of Srila Guru Dev. Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu Apara Mahimanita Bhaja Mahi Prema Murti Narayana Guru Pungavam Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu We have heard about Srila Rudra Saipad He composed a book Srila Guru Dev used to tell the all definition of bhakti and related to bhakti is in Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu We have seen in book form but if we discuss the speciality of Srila Gurudev, Srila Gurudev is himself 
एम्बोडिमेंट ऑफ सिलो भक्ति सिलो रुग्ण सही पार भक्ति रसामित तो सिंधु इफ स्कूटनी इस इस करैक्टर इस पास टाइम्स देन ईच एंड एवरी स्टेप वी कैन अंडरस्टैंड इस एम्बोडिमेंट ऑफ भक्ति रसामित तो सिंधु अपारो महिमानितम हाउ मेनी ग्लोरीज यस आल लिमिटेड ग्लोरीज इफ वी सी इस एनी Day of his lifestyle, how he used to maintain his life. Mercifully, he kept me very close to him. So, for that reason, I can understand something by his godless mercy. And his glorification will be glorified by other devotees later on. So, paro mahi manitam bhaja mahi. We are doing bhajan of his lotus feet. So here bhaja is plural number, not singular number, for everyone. Prema Murtim is embodiment of love. Srila so Gurudev is to tell always, love is God, God is love. Bhagavan himself, embodiment of love. So love is God, God is love. And Srila so Gurudev is to tell, if you want to control anyone, only can control by love and affection not by administration and not by stick shila guru de by his loving deal he control everybody and wherever he should travel he should tell especially in first or second tour that i not come to collect anything here i came only to give not to collect anything I have, there is no lacking in broth for chapati and dal. So I not came here, came here to collect anything from anyone. I only one thing I will collect, what is that? Your heart. I will take your heart and purify it and give to the lotus hand of my Shila Guru Padma. Through Guru Parampara, I will send to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu to the lotus feet and the lotus feet of divine couple. First time when Sri Gurudev traveled in America, Gurudev was in New Jersey, one disciple of Sri Bhakti Vedanta Swami Maharaj named Jai Ram Prabhu. Gurudev was there and about five, six group of people came to meet with Gurudev. Gurudev was inside his room. I told him that somebody has come to meet with you. Gurudev came out. They asked question. We have heard about you. We have come. So we, do. we came to meet with you. So who are you came America? This is the first question. You have come from poor country India. What you can give to America? Who are you came? Why not preaching in India? Then Buddha replied, You may think that India is a poor country according to your own viewpoint. But I not come from poor country. I came from most prosperous country of the world. And not only that, you may think the Prime Minister or President of our country may come to you beg something but I am exceptional case from my birth I never know how to beg I know how to donate only then they ask what will donate then Gurudev told that the richest culture in the world only Indian culture Indian Vedic culture no one is can compare with Indian Vedic culture then Buddha was listen. If there is a pond and if you throw a stone, what will be the result? Then they told some ripple will come. Buddha told no, not some ripple will come. It will come one after another, bigger, smaller, 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 unless until the ripples are not touching the shore of the pond, it never be subside. Although all this materialized, we could not see this. If you see through modern technology, through microscope you can see the waves are going and touching. 
Then they ask again, what is related about this? That you want to preach in America? Then Guru Dev told that which we are speaking, Hari Katha, or doing Kirtan, will make some waves in the ether and it will touch each and every corner of the world and purify the environment. And nowadays, biggest problem in the world is sound pollution. Sound pollution only survived by Harinam Sankirtan and Hari Katha. Then they become surprised. Thus, are you a scientist? You don't know I am not a scientist. I came from a village, I have no idea about what is science. Another told, mm-hmm. without being a scientist, none can give this example. So they no, I am not a scientist. Then third told, no, please tell, you must be a scientist. They told, yes, science means knowledge and big gun means realized knowledge. Which I have heard from Sila Mai, Sila Guru Maharaj, Sila Bhakti Pragyan Kesavva Sai Maharaj and by his costless mercy, what I did bhajan, I realized I told to you. Then mother, yes, this is correct that without being realized, none can tell this. Then Guru Dev told, are you a scientist? Then they began to laugh. Well, he has always a scientist group and working about sound pollution. So we have traveled all over the world, India too. We recorded each and every kind of sound, what is possible, either mechanical, any species, any living being, we have recorded and we have recorded in India. We have noticed so many saintly persons, they are doing bhajan and Mahamantra hours and hours and hours they never became tired. So then recording everything that we played in our laboratory, each and every sound making sound pollution higher we have seen and scale. Only by this Harinam Sankirtan and Mahamantra we have noticed is coming down. So you are perfect and you will be grand success preaching in America, not only that, all over the world. Then they give their identification. He told, who is the head of that, told, I was disciple of Srila Bhaktan Sami Maharaj. Later on, I took Sannas from Pujjabad Bhakti Raksha Siddhar Goswami Maharaj. Then I gave up everything, came in sanitize again. Then what? His name was Madhav Puri. So his handwriting with me also I have. Uh, while Guru Dev the second or third volume will come, his own handwriting will be printed there also. So if Guru Dev is so glorified, then his Guru Maharaj, how much will be glorified? You can imagine seeing Guru Dev activity, his preaching and his bhajan pranali. We have to go to Jamuna for Sankalpa and so many activities and Puspanjali here so I am finishing here Hare Krishna Bansha Kalpataru Pasya Kripa Sindhu Bhaya Vacha Patitanam Pavanipho Vishnadipho Namo Namaha Sila Gurudev Biraha Visheshanka, fourth volume has come and about this Sipad Bhakti Vedanta Siddhanti Mahajan announced and after Sankalpa will go to Rahada Madar temple I have the inauguration of Puspa Samadhi both our Guru Vargas is there you have heard from Sipad Tirtha Maharaj for Guru Dev Samadhi Mandir, all Anukur loss means all financial expenses weared by our Shibad Jagannath Punja Fiji. And for my Guru Maharaj Samadhi Mandir, who has 
help I don't know whoever may be help both samadhis we are debted to them for eternally Hare Krishna now first Bhakti Vedanta Siddhanti Maharaj so here different Gurudev lecture and lecture of different Gaudiya Vaishnavas is here in Hindi it's available here Hare Krishna Jnanatimirandasya Jnananjana Shalakaya Chakshuran Militam Dhyena Tasmai Shri Gurave Nama Vansha Kalpatarubhyascha Kripa Sindhubhya Evacha Patitanam Bhavane Vyo Vaishnave Vyo Namo Namaha Gurave Gaura Chandraya Radhikaya Itadalaya Krishnaya Krishna Bhaktaya Tadabhaktaya namo namaha Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Shri Advaita Gadadhar Shri Vasadi Gaur Bhakta Vrinda Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare I'm offering my Unlimited Dandabhat Pranams, my Shraddha Pushpanjali's the Lotus Feet of my beloved Gurudev, Nitilila Pravishta, Om Vishnu Pad Asto Tarasata, Sri Srila A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Maharaj Srila Prabhupada. I'm offering my equal Dandabhat Pranams, my Shraddha Pushpanjali to the Lotus Feet of my beloved Siksha Gurudevs. <coughs> Nitilila Pravishta Om Vishnu Padasto Tarasata Sri Shila Bhaktivedanta Narayana Goswami Maharaj and Nitilila Pravishta Om Vishnu Padasto Tarasata Sri Shila Bhakti Rakshak Sri Dhar Goswami Maharaj. My unlimited Dandavat pranams to the lotus feet of my Mm. Param Guru Dev Nitya Pravishta Om Vishnu Parasto Tarasata Sri Shila Bhakti Pragyan Keshav Goswami Maharaj whose divine uh, disappearance day we are observing today and my Dandavat Pranams to the lotus feet of Nitya Lila Pravishta Om Vishnu Parashila Bhakti Vedanta Vaman Goswami Maharaj Nitya Lila Pravishta Sri Shila Gaur Govinda Goswami Maharaj Nitilila Pravishta Shishila Bhakti Pramod Puri Goswami Maharaj and all of our Shri Shri Rupa Anuga Guru Varga. My Dandavat Pranams to the lotus feet of all the Vaishnavas and Vaishnavis in this auspicious assembly headed by Tridandi Sanyasi Gan, uh, especially Param Pujapad. Srila Bhaktivedanta Tirtha Maharaj Param Pujapad Srila Bhaktivedanta Madhav Maharaj <clears throat> We have heard from the lotus mouth of Srila Tirtha Maharaj Srila Madhav Maharaj the most wonderful opening and inauguration of this most auspicious Sri Praj Mandala Parikrama and the remembrance of our beloved Srila Gurudev which is deeply embedded in their hearts and in the hearts of all the Vaishnavas present. On this day we cannot uh, avoid the deep moods of feeling separation and as Tirtha Maharaj told, also great joy at the same time, mixed together. And we observed on this day so many uh, times when sh this first day of Kartik would come, full moon day, how our Srila Gurudev would sit here on this dais and he would offer his pranams 
to the lotus seat of his beloved Gurudev, Srila Bhakti Pargyan Keshav Goswami Maharaj. And it was evident to all how Srila Gurudev was completely immersed and swimming in an ocean of divine separation moods from his Guru Maharaj. He could barely pronounce the Pranam Mantra. He would simply say, Nama Om Vishnu Padaya, and then he would stop. He could not continue. So we cannot fathom what is the actual depth of the moods of deep attachment, love and affection that our Gurudev has for his Guru Maharaj how his Guru Maharaj has for his Guru Maharaj and all of our Rupanuga Guru Varga how all are feeling this deep attachment and affection to the lotus feet of their Gurudev as expressed by Srila Narottam Das Thakur in his famous song and prayer Sri Guru Charana Padma Kevala Bhakati Sadama Vandon Mui Savadhana Mati there he's telling Sri Guru Charane Rati E Se Uttama Gati Ye Prasade Pure Sarva Asha So this is the essence of the bhakti <coughs> which our Guru Parampara are introducing how deeply attached to the lotus seat of Sri Guru and in this way attached to the lotus feet of all the uh, Guru Parampara and connecting up to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Sri Nityananda Prabhu and Sri Panchatattva and all the associates of Gauranga Mahaprabhu and ultimately to the lotus feet of Sri Sri Radha and Krishna in Braj Mandala. So this day, the disappearance day of Srila Bhakti Pragyan Keshav Maharaj we have had always so much opportunity to hear directly from the lotus mouth of Srila Gurudev the divine glories of his Guru Maharaj and how Srila Gurudev himself produced the transcendental biography of Srila Bhakti Pragyan Keshav Maharaj and declared his qualities and his glories to the entire world. Uh, actually those of us who came from Istan so many years association with our Guru Maharaj and his teachings, Srila Bhaktivedanta Swami Maharaj. Uh, we understood who was the sannyas guru of our Guru Maharaj. We knew his name, but in actuality we did not know anything about him. What was the stature, what was the nature of his service to Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Thakur. What was the relationship between our Guru Maharaj, uh, Bhaktivedanta Swami Maharaj, and his sannyas guru. Uh, so many things were completely unknown to us. Only we heard that, oh, uh, when, our, when the divine disappearance day of Srila Bhakti Pragyan Kesha Maharaj happened in 19... What is it? 68. Yes, 1968. We were aware that our Guru Maharaj uh, sent a letter of condolence. But even we didn't know about his lecture that he gave on that day and how he wept and cried in separation and remembered the mercy that he had received from his Guru Maharaj, Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Thakur, through this God brother. Srila Bhakti Pragyan Kesha Maharaj. We did not know all of these details. But when we came into the association of our Srila Gurudev, Srila Bhakti Vedanta Narayan Maharaj, then he shined a bright lamp of illumination on this divine personality. And for the first time, we began to understand what a most exalted Mahabhagavat Rasik Vaishnava this personality is and how he is eternally connected 
uh, in the service of Shishi Radha and Krishna in Braj with our Guru Maharaj and our Rupanuga Guru Varga. And we began to understand how exalted is this personality because if he was not so exalted, how could he have such exalted disciples? Like our Srila uh, Bhaktivedanta Narayan Goswami Maharaj, Srila Bhaktivedanta Vaman Goswami Maharaj, Srila Bhaktivedanta Trivikram Maharaj, and such elevated sannyas disciple, Srila Bhaktivedanta Swami Maharaj, who took the teachings of Goranga Mahaprabhu throughout the length and breadth of the whole world, being also encouraged and empowered by him, by receiving sannyas from him. All of these significant points we did not understand until we heard from the lotus mouth of our Gurudev and read the transcendental biography of this exalted Paramahansa Mahabhagavat. So year after year after year, we would have the opportunity on this glorious day, the first day of Kartik, to reflect and to remember deeply in our hearts these transcendental pastimes of a, of a pure devotee and how he was the topmost servitor of Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Prabhupada and how he re-established this transcendental preaching mission of Sri Gaudiya Mutt at a time when it was practically dissolving and would have been lost all the efforts so Srila Bhakti Pragyan Kesha Maharaj came together with our Srila Bhakti Vedanta Swami Maharaj and also with who is the third person? Bhakti Kamala Madhusudan Maharaj. These three God brothers, they formed together and they started the transcendental preaching mission of Sri Gaudi Vedanta Samiti. Uh, and in this way, all of the preaching was again restarted. So our, our knowledge of the glories of Srila Bhakti Pragyan Kesha Maharaj and how he started, restarted this preaching mission, how he preached tirelessly, extraordinary energy expended, how he established Siddhanta, how he preached the message of Gauravani, uh, and how so many Vaishnavas came to his lotus feet, how he uh, re-established this Braj Mandala Parikrama which had stopped, Gaur Mandala Parikrama, all of these things, these glories we learned from the lotus mouth of our Gurudev. So this is the uh, good fortune for us that such a divine personality in our Guru Parampara, he became manifested in the hearts of all the devotees throughout the world. And in this way, it will continue uh, for generations to come that our Gurudev established his glories. And in the same way, our Gurudev, uh, who, under whose guidance we are performing this parikrama, who led us on this parikrama for so many years, uh, we are also proclaiming his glories by coming here to this Braj Mandala Parikrama. All the devotees throughout the world have gathered this Shraddha in their hearts for Srila Gurudev and following his desire and having this seed implanted in their hearts of this attraction to come to Braj to hear this transcendental Hari Katha on Braj Mandala Parikrama. This is the glories of our Gurudev. And this is the beginning now of proclaiming His glories throughout the world after His divine disappearance. This will go on for generations to come. And Srila Gurudev, His transcendental Samadhi, established today at the Sri Radha Damodar Temple. Very rare that any great Acharya can have his Samadhi in that sacred, sacred courtyard right at the lotus feet of Srila Jiva Goswami Pad, at the lotus feet of Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami, at the lotus feet of Srila Rupa Goswami, and all the great servitors in their line, they are only allowed to be in that courtyard. So today, on this glorious first day of Karti Braj Mandala Parikrama, the first year after the disappearance of our Gurudev, we are establishing Him in that place, His divine Pushpa Samadhi, for all future generations of Vaishnavas to understand who is this Mahabhagwat? 
Who is this Rasik Vaishnava who took the glories of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, explained the transcendental mystery of his divine appearance within this world? He explained what is this uh, transcendental relationship between Radha and Krishna. He illuminated all the glories of Rupanuga Guru Varga, of Rupanuga Dara. That divine personality will be remembered for generations and hundreds of years to come. And so today, this most auspicious day, we are bowing down at his lotus feet, praying at his lotus feet, that he will shower his mercy and blessings upon us and all, and all of his disciples throughout the world, that they can be completely immersed in this transcendental Harikata for one month of this Braj Mandala Parikrama and continue throughout the year and spread the glories of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu throughout the world under his divine guidance. Gaur Primanandi Hari Hari Bo Srila Bhakti Vedanta Narayan Goswami Maharaj Ki Srila Bhakti Prakyan Keshav Goswami Maharaj Ki Srila Bhakti Vedanta Bhavan Goswami Maharaj Kid, Shiva Bhakti Vedanta Swami Maharaj Kid, Shri Rupa Nuga Guru Varga Kid, Samameer Bhakta Vrinda Kid, Nitai Kaur Pramanande. So we could not neglect them. So before Pushpanjali, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Sarva Pratham, Asmadiya Guru Pad Padmo, Nitpadila Prishtam Vishnu Pad, Ashtutra Satasthi Srimadu Bhakti Vedam, Salvaman Goshe Maharaj, Evang Nitpadila Prishtam Vishnu Pad, Ashtutra Srimadu Bhakti Vedam, Silo Nan Goshe Maharaj, Ravai Charan Kamani, Sastanga Dandavat Gyapan Kari Tattvashat Nitpadila Prishtam Vishnu Pad Ashutra Sathmada Bhakti Vedanta Sushnai Maharaj Evam Manchastha Virajman Prapujya Charan Sannasi Vrinda Evam Samastha Vaishna Vaishna Vrinda Matri Vrinda Gaurgata Shajjan Vrinda Harikatha Kipasu Sastri Vrinda Shabar Charan Kamali आमार दानरबासी कार होंगे। बंगाल भाषा के वलाजन में हमारे आदिस प्राप्त हुए थे। आज हमारा सरोद पुरनिवा तिथि से विशेष उत्सव हमारा उत्जापन करते जा रहे हैं। एक तो सरोद पुरनिवा दीदी हो चुके हमारे परम गुरुदेव नित्य लीला प्रस्तंग विष्णु पाद आशुतरो सत्मादे भक्ति प्रकान केशव गुस्सई महाराजे सुबह तिरोहार की थी श्री गुरुदेव ए तिथि ते ए दिने इन कथा सुनकर भावे मधुर शरी वन मिनट ऑल डिवोटेड प्लीज सी डाउन एंड प्लीज हियर हरि कथा so, Pujapat one was speaking, and sannyasis by nine, they can come, give Pushman till the other way. So, all together, big crowd, big problem. So, in this way, Harikatha Rani, and everyone slowly, slowly, come, crumb by crumb, step by step, come in and go into oh, Pushman Jali. Now, Pujapat one was speaking, and everyone listen to Harikatha. Today, Madhur Shari, Kirtan Kutten, Vishesh Kari, Trinitar, Gurudevi Charane Ji Hardi Puspanjali Nivedan Kurten Sirupa Manjali Pada Saimur Sampada Jai Bhav Aditini Udgar Kurten Sri Kathaglu Smaran Pari Aaj Ehi Sarat Puri Maankirtini Pandan Kurten Sri Madhav Hagvatera Madhye Sri Sukhdev Kusamai Pad Ehi Sarat Ri Tur जे बनो ना कर चें इत्थं सरदम सक्षम जलंग पदमा करम सुगंधी ना बरसात रिक्ते समस्त नदी नाला जल कर्दमाक तो है जाए किंतु सरकाल असार संगे संगे वह समस्त 
नदी नाला सरोवर आदि समस्त जल स्वच्छ निर्मल धारण करे एवं से सरोवर के मध्य सुगंधी युक्त कमल आदि प्रस्फुटित हो तई सुखदेव गोस्वामी पाद बोल इत्थम सरदम स्वच्छ जलम पदमा करम सुगंधी ना एमन सुंदर जी सुरम्य जो परिवेश जे परिवेश मध्य समस्त पशु पक्षी और मानवादी समस्त हृदय जन आनंद उद्बलित है मयूर मयूर से नृत्य शुरू कर भ्रमर भ्रमर गुंजन आदि ककिल आदि से द्वारा मुखरित कर आकर्षित कर संगे गोचारण प्रवेश कर गुरुजन तबरुद्ध मध्य से गोविंद बेनुध्वनि गमन करें सौंदर्य रूप से वर्णन कर शरतकाल मध्य कृष्ण बेनुध्वनि जो कर आकर्षित कर सुखदेव गोस्वी पाद बोल वृंदावन सखी भुव जग राम कृष्ण चरण स्पर्श मान वृंदावन सखी भुव जग देव की सुतो पदा लक्ष्मी लक्ष्मी गोविंद में मयूर प्रेक्षादृशन परतन समस्त सत्यम इस श्लोक मध्य वर्णन कर मध्य वृंदावन सखी भूमि भो वितनोति कृत्य सखी देखो आज वृंदावन जो महिमा सर्वत्र किस 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 प्रकार के कैमने सर्वत्र उद्घोषित हो वर्णन कर गोविंद बेनुध्वनि श्रवण कर मयूर मयूर गिरिराज गोवर्धन सिंह देश थे निजे तराई अंचले मयूर मयूर से गोविंद चरण चरण चिन्ह द्वारा सुशोभित है ब्रह्मा आदि पर देवता लोक से वृंदावन से 